Melon and Planter. And today I have two packages to open for you. One is just a quick box. I ordered something from Pistols Nursery. It's something that I've wanted for quite some time to complete my collection and I'll let you know what that is. And I also have, my cat's trying to get me, I also have a huge package from Tropical Plant Supply, which is my go-to for rare plants. Okay, let's see what Pistols has for me. I open that horrible. Oh yeah, and my mom fussed at me, and my husband tried to fuss at me for the way that I opened this, but this little guy, I'm going to put a link to it down below because it's amazing. You can't really cut yourself with it. It's just some hard plastic, so... I'm okay. This is really cute, actually, what they do. They have a little pistols card. <clears throat> And they give you your invoice. Then they also give you a thank you. I think I have two here. I can't grab them. So there's a thank you, and it tells a little bit about their staff and their company. That's cool. And then they also have houseplant best practices and general houseplant care. So I really like that. I'm going to take a look at that later. Nice. I like when they ship them out. Pop. Let me put this over. Okay. Wow. This is some interesting stuff on top. I think it just got a little moved around. So, some of the dirt came out. That's good. I'm probably going to end up repotting this pretty soon. So, let me show you. <clears throat> this is my Zinzi. It's so cool. Because I have the Raven, ZZ, the regular, and then I have a variegated. So, now I have the Zinzi to complete my little gang. Cat, leave my stuff alone. Ooh, okay. Ready for tropical plant supply? Okay, so on the outside of the package, it's a big package. On the outside, he has everything that you need. The phytosanitary certificate, customs declaration, all that. Very legit. And this is like, I don't know how many times I've ordered from Todd. He's... Amazing, so easy to do business with, great prices, just arrives fast, great packaging, just no complaints at all. I've ordered from him like probably almost 10 times now. Here he was six. I had to go meet my mailman outside. I had one package that was like in December where it got stuck in customs and most of the plants were still okay, so shows this packaging is just so today I only ordered um, a few plants from him usually I order 12 max but I had to order a little bit less because I got a plus stat my husband's not too happy because our house is literally just all around me is just plants like the only room that doesn't have plants is my dressing room back there so he's not happy but my greenhouse is coming soon. OMG. Okay. This is huge. Wow. Look at this big guy. My cat is really interested. Oh, it keeps going. <laughs> wow. That's awesome. It's taller than me. It's literally taller than me. I'm short. Sure. Wow, I have to go and like drape this somewhere. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I love it. Looks like this guy fell out of his packaging. But it's okay. 
Let's see. It's probably going to lose some leaves, but this is my Epipremnum Skeleton Key. See? You can see the little keys. Nice. Okay. If I can set that there. Okay. And next we have the Yes, yes, I don't know how to say it. So, this one, they do look a little banged up. They just need some water and they'll rehab just fine. And the Gigas just kind of like looks like that. It's gonna be beautiful. Once I get them planted, I'm probably gonna have to go and get some more pots so I can do some planting right after this. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> okay, so I got a second one of these that I love my first one so much. So this is the Philodendron 69896. Definitely one of my favorite plants ever. So if I like something, I get a second one. This one looks the best out of the bunch so far. It's beautiful. And it's huge and it has a new little leaf coming. I don't know if you can see. Mm, yeah, put this one over here. Okay, I think we're getting close to the end. Let's see. Oh, I ordered a little bit more. Oh yeah, I forgot about this one. <clears throat> this one is the Philodendron Florida Narrow, and I liked this one as soon as I saw it because it kind of looks like the Longilla, how do you say it, Longilla bottom? So it's really beautiful. Look at those leaves, such funny shaped leaves. <laughs> and I like little alien plants like that, so. It's perfect. Oh, this is what I've been wanting so long. This is my dream plant. Sorry, my cat is running on this wheel. This is Epiprimnoid. Monstera Epiprimnoid. Look at that. Look at those holes. These don't travel too well, but this one is gorgeous. He, he warned me ahead of time that one or two leaves are a little messed up and might not make it, but this guy's gonna live and be beautiful. <laughs> I can't wait to get these potted. I might go and pot these really quick so I can show you how they look once they're potted. Probably later on tonight. I'm gonna have to go run to the mall to get my husband his ring. Okay, I'm gonna go buy his ring and then get some pots for these beauties. Like, look at that. And overall, I'm really happy with the plants. Some of them, they're a little unhappy because that sucks to be in a box forever, but they're all gonna live. They all look bomb, so. Thank you so much, Todd. I can't wait to order again. Like, I'm probably gonna order really soon. Okay, thanks so much for watching. I hope that you have the greatest day and you buy some plants. See you later.